Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna review, I'm not like review, but I'm gonna compare these two tinted moisturizers, the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer and the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. <laughs> But before we start comparing these two tinted moisturizers, if you like beauty, travel, fashion, more like lifestyle, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you get notified every time I make videos like this. So yes, we are comparing two of the best tinted moisturizers and especially now, and I really think that no makeup makeup look is still in. So if you really want to achieve that no makeup makeup look, tinted moisturizer is really your go-to makeup product. For this side is the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer and on this side is the and on this side is the Laura Mercier Skin Perfector Tinted Moisturizer. For the NARS, I'm in the shade St. Moritz and for the Laura Mercier, I'm in the shade 1W1 Porcelain. And it's been three hours since I applied the two tinted moisturizers. Again, this side is the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer, and on this side is the Laura Mercier Skin Perfector Tinted Moisturizer. And as you can see, it's shiny siya on my T zone. And just so you know, before I forget, just so you know, I have a combination skin type. So my T-zone usually gets oilier like part and also hair on my chin. Besides on face, not that dry, but it's normal compared to this side, especially say like the T-zone. Also, I did not set this with a powder just so you guys could really see what it looks like naturally. So this is just like my skin and the tinted moisturizer. So now I'm going to start comparing these two tinted moisturizers and by comparing, I'm going to state their, their similarities and also their differences. So let's start first with their similarities. Both of these products have SPF 30 PA++++ and both of these products have 50 milliliter. For the price, I think NARS is a bit more expensive but not really like, I think 
I'm not sure with the price, but I'm just gonna put it here for the price. So anyway, for the differences, but before I tell you that, you know, I don't really have high expectations for tinted moisturizers because they are not long wearing foundations or like heavy foundations. They're just basically moisturizers with with a tint. That's, so that's why they're called tinted moisturizers. They're not foundations or, or whatnot. So they don't really conceal blemishes or flaws and whatnot. I do have some bumps here and it doesn't really conceal. I mean, both of these products don't really conceal any of those blemishes. And I get that because it's a tinted moisturizer. Again, it's not a foundation. It's not a concealer or the difference really between these two products and I've been using, and as you all know, I've been using this NARS tinted moisturizers like for a year now. Yeah. And this one, it's like a month now. And the only thing that I can say is that if you want a bit of coverage, go for NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer. Not like super coverage, huh? just a bit, just a bit coverage. Go for it. How can you say this? It's like um, both of these moisturizers don't conceal. But if you want a bit of coverage, go for this one. And both of these products are very light, I swear. It's like I'm not wearing any any makeup at all. And if you would ask me which one to buy again, I'd buy NARS. Just because I like the shade range of the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer compared to Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. And yes, that's about it. I'm gonna end my makeup review here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!